Avigdor Lieberman never misses a chance to speak his mind, and that's exactly what the foreign minister did regarding the Palestinian Authority this week. He said every conversation begins with claims by the PA that Israel is not sincere in negotiations. Lieberman called the tactic a larger scheme that seeks to delegitimize Israel. He said another favorite tactic of the PA is to get foreign governments to issue arrest warrants for Israeli officials. Lieberman argued the government cannot cooperate with the Palestinians on security and economic matters while they continue to file lawsuits against Israel. Defense Minister Ehud Barak hinted at differences with America before a meeting with U.S. Joint Chief of Staffs Admiral Mike Mullen. Barak said even between friends there are differences, but also ways to solve problems. The two met at the IDF's Tel Aviv compound to discuss ways for further cooperation between the two countries. Mullen said the U.S. and Israel must continue to work together to resolve the region's problems. Fallen Prime Minister Ehud Olmert's corruption trial may be postponed by up to three months. Jerusalem District Prosecutor Elia Babanel called for the delay after the Deputy District Prosecutor, Ori Korev, was put on forced vacation after calling the judges, quote, donkeys. Babanel said Korev knows the smallest details of the case and that it would be foolish to continue without him. Olmert's lawyers said they saw no reason why the trial should be delayed. Hamas has a British documentary filmmaker behind bars after he entered Gaza to show support for a Palestinian accused of collaborating with Israel. Paul Martin will serve 15 days for the offense. The Hamas decision to hold Martin surprised many in the journalistic community as the group has largely had a hands-off approach to foreign correspondence since seizing the Strip in 2007. Lawyers for Yaakov Daitel tested the Jerusalem District Court by asking for a psychological examination of their client. The court agreed, thus delaying the trial by one month. Title stands accused of committing acts of terror against missionaries who try to convert Jews to Christianity in Israel. Title worked with the group Yad Lachim, which sought to bring Jews who have converted to other religions or married non-Jewish spouses back to Judaism.